It's been another busy weekend of Serie A action. There was a big surprise in Parma as Jose Mauri became the first player to score against Juventus in 431 minutes. The Argentines' goal on the hour mark, the only shot on target the crisis hit hosts registered. This match should teach us a lesson. You have to win every game on the pitch. I'm disappointed, obviously, but I believe this defeat will be good for us in the long run. Inter goalkeeper Samir Handanovic was drawing plaudits after their 3-0 win over Hellas Verona. The Slovenian denied a Luka Toni penalty, taking his overall record from the spot to 21 saves out of 57, the best record in Serie A. I believe Handanovic is one of the best goalkeepers in Europe, so I'm confident that we'll find a deal with him. I'm not into all the details, but I know that he's discussing his contract extension with the club. I'm sure that we'll soon find a solution and make him stay at Inter. Napoli returned to winning ways thanks to Marek Hamšík. The Slovakian forward has been instrumental in his side's last five games, scoring three and providing assists for the other two. Filippo Inzaghi's Milan couldn't beat Sampdoria, but it certainly wasn't for a lack of trying. They had a record 26 shots at the San Siro. Alessandro Cerci had five of those, but Dutchman Nigel de Jong was the man to find the back of the net. We had to be more clinical, better in passing and in front of goal. We had great possession, a lot of shots. In the second half, Mihailovic changed a few things, and this allowed Eto to make that wonderful pass, where we had to be more careful.